Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fireside Terra. I hope everyone is well. If you're new to our little channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. It's Friday. Y'all know what that means. It's time for the weekend top and bottom of the deck reading. For those of you who are new here, don't know how we do this, I go by the elements. It's Taurus season still, so we're going to start off with the earth element. If you're not sure where your sun sign falls as far as the elements go, I will call them out as I read the different elements. If your sun sign doesn't resonate by the elements, check your moon rising or Venus sign. Same as a general reading for the zodiacs. Time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. Might even play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. Same as the general readings I do for the zodiacs. I just do it by the elements because it goes a little bit faster that way. And I try to keep these short, sweet, and to the point so I don't take up too much of you guys' time. And as per typical on a Friday, right after I get done doing this, I have to scoot out the door and go to my bread and butter job. So, Friday is like my Monday. Seriously, because I have Thursdays off and I have Tuesdays off. So there's that four-day stretch where... I'm constantly around people and other people's energy. And it's extremely draining <laughs> for me to <laughs> try to read cards over a weekend. So, yeah. Enough about me. We're talking about you guys. Alright, we're almost there. One more shuffle. Taurus Virgo Capricorn. It's not that I don't love people, because I love people. I don't like their energy sometimes. Especially when they're a bunch of negative Nancys, and everybody's grumpy, and I don't like it. I don't like unhappy energy. It kind of bums me out. All right. The star, Seven of Pentacles. Okay. Very nice. Might be an Aquarius you're dealing with. That's cool. It's a card of wish fulfillment. With a card of patience. You've waited patiently. Things are finally starting to go your way. That's awesome. Okay. Right on. What happened in the past? Ten of Wands in the upright, Queen of Wands in the reverse. A burden was released. Okay. You laid your burdens down. Something ended. We'll find out why the Queen of Wands is reversed here in just a couple of seconds. I'm, I'm sensing a halt or a pause in something. Might have been a connection with a fire sign. I don't know. We'll get clarity in a second. But burdens were lifted and released. A cycle ended. Two of Pentacles, four of Swords reversed. All right. A little bit of juggling going on. Might have been some financial balancing. I don't know. Some emotional balancing made you a little bit restless. Okay. It's coming up for you this weekend. No. Ace of Cups reversed. Princess of Wands reversed. Hmm. Something positive is coming. It's not going to seem positive at first. Are you tracking? All right, let's get some clarity. Why is the Ten of Wands upright and the Queen of Wands reversed here? Justice in the reverse. Okay. Burdensome cycle ended. 
something came to a halt. Something came to a pause. Caused a little bit of an imbalance. Okay. It may have seemed unfair, unjust at first. I'm, I'm hearing a decision was taken out of your hands. You'd been kicking the ball around about something for a while. This might be work related, I don't know. It did not seem so rosy at first, but a burden was lifted. Okay. Good things come out of bad situations all the time. Why is the Two of Pentacles and the Four of Swords reversed here? You want to come out and play? Seven of Cups. You did some weighing of options. You were restless. Options opened up to you. Look at these cups. Some of these cups have some awesome stuff in them. Some of these cups have some not so often stuff in them. Okay. It's called free will. It's called your choice. A burden was lifted from you. Something you've been kicking the ball around about for a while. Now, then you had options. Which one do I choose? What do I do? It made you restless. You couldn't decide. You had to wait it out. You had to figure out what your wish was. You had to figure out what you had been waiting for. It's called having patience with the universe. Okay, what's coming in for this weekend? Ace of Cups reversed, Princess of Wands reversed. Why is the Ace of Cups reversed and the Princess of Wands reversed here for my Earth signs for this weekend? Thanks. Six of Cups reversed. No new start in love. No communication. Salty bad memories. Now we're getting somewhere. Can I get another card on that, please? Okay, I'll take two. Princess of Swords and the Seven of Swords reversed. So this weekend, this weekend might be a little bit rough, but but something positive is going to come out of it. Something that's been a long time coming. Something you've been waiting for. Truth. Honesty. You'll find out the truth about a situation and why something can't come back around. That's very interesting. Okay. Possibly an old wound being opened back up a little bit. Three of Pentacles. Everything is going to come together. New foundations, new opportunities, the healing that you've been waiting for, the wish fulfillment that you've been waiting for, the thing that you've wanted about a given situation, something that did not seem fair just at first, 
but it opened up opportunities for new things. It's coming around this weekend, or it signs. That's awesome. That's awesome. I'm happy for you. Little bits of advice. Strengthen the Queen of Cups. Okay. That's amazing. Love yourself. Open yourself up to give and receive love. It's okay. Don't emotionally close yourself off to it. And be strong. Don't allow yourself to be over-dominated. Don't be a doormat. That's amazing. I love it. I'm also hearing... It may not be what you're used to. And it may come from an unlikely source. I don't know why I just heard that. But, Earth Signs. There you go. Okay. water. Sorry, air. Air is next. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I didn't like that last shovel. We're doing that one more time. It was too chunky. I don't like chunky shuffles. Ace of Wands in the world. That's fantastic. New passions erupting. New fires starting. Cycles ending, new cycles beginning. I like it. I like it. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, I like it. In the past, we have a tower and a king of cups reversed. Well, shoot. Something went to crap. The tower fell. And you were emotionally closed off for a while. I can see that happening. I can totally see that happening. Once bitten, twice shy. Apparently it was pretty cataclysmic. Or it seemed that way at the time. Remember, the theme of the day is... Things work themselves out. And good things come out of the most terrible situations. Okay. Nine of Swords in the reverse and the King of Wands in the upright. After a while, you put this out of your head, and it was full, full steam ahead. And let's go. Let's do this. Let's take on the world. Okay. In time. You, so you let the dust settle. Eventually, put it out of your head. Things were good. Okay. What's coming in for this weekend? Four of cups reversed and four of swords. Oh me, oh my. Four of Cups reversed, Four of Swords reversed. Those are upside down fours. That is indicative of someone fighting impending change. throw a clarifier on that. Yeah. Alright. 
Why is the Four of Cups, five, uh, Four of Swords here? Gave me two. Page of Swords and the Nine of Wands reversed. <clears throat> Communication comes in to make cause you to have to put some walls down. Possibly communication from someone you've been ignoring might cause a little bit of restless energy. Can I a couple more on that, please. One more. Just on the Four of Cups reversed. One card just on the Four of Cups reversed. The Fool, that gave me two, Seven of Wands reversed. This Cataclysm may have been a confrontation. Fool's Aries might be a fire sign you're dealing with. Potentially an Aries. Ignoring an opportunity to take a leap of faith because it involves you having to lay down weapons and having to disregard old feelings. This calls for weapons down, walls down. You're gonna get communication this weekend. Somebody may wanna reignite an old flame. Possibly someone you've been ignoring. Just the Four of Swords reversed, please. Just the Four of Swords reversed. I don't think you ever total I don't think you ever totally put this out of your head, air signs. I think you were really Hold on. Good grief. Go away. I don't want to clean my computer right now. <laughs> I asked for a cleaning, really? I'm in the middle of doing something. Anyway, where was I? I don't think you ever totally put this out of your head. I think you just shoved it so far into the back of your brain. You just ignored how it made you feel and you didn't do anything with it. But something this weekend is going to spark some restless energy in regards to why it didn't come together. Why the foundation was so shaky. Why the tower fell. Okay. But old cycles will close out. New cycles will begin. Take it however resonates. We're not going to go any further into this. I'm just going to give you some advice. <laughs> Knight of Cups reversed, Eight of Wands reversed. If this is old non-committal Joe or Jane, because the sex of the card isn't important, trying to come back, um, unless they're going to come back and actually want to commit, don't, don't, just let them keep going. <laughs> 
don't give it a second thought. Just don't, don't even, don't even, don't even acknowledge it. And certainly, don't let it make you restless, unless that's what you want and stuff. I mean, you know, it's your life. It's whatever. I just read the cards. King of Swords and the Six of Pentacles. Unless they're gonna come back, true, and even the scales up a little bit. You need to make a logical decision and a logical choice, not an emotional one. Air signs are perfectly capable of making logical, non-emotional decisions. That's why you're air signs. Okay. I think you guys are good. Next. Water signs. My friends, the water signs. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Two of Cups in the reverse. Queen of Swords. Okay. She's a beautiful ice queen, isn't she? She's logical and she demands the truth from her subjects. And I think this weekend, truth's going to come out as to why a connection didn't quite connect. Find out what happened in the past. Justice reversed, Queen of Wands in the upright. Mm -hmm. First thought that pops into my head, um, things may not have been fair and equal in the bedroom with a little something something that could have been the case could have just been a fire sign you were dealing with or a Libra things weren't fair things weren't even things may have got heated and confrontational because of that next Potentially could have been a disconnect. Y'all could have met something new, someone new. Blessed union or a karmic life blessing. Take the hierophant however you want. We'll throw a clarifier on it, maybe. Okay, so if it went Splitsville and y'all met new people, what's coming in this weekend? Ten of Wands reversed, Seven of Swords reversed. Oh boy. Oh, my water signs. Someone coming in to get something off of their chest, potentially, that they haven't yet, and come back with the truth. Okay. Can I get a clarifier on the Ten of Wands reversed and the Seven of Swords reversed, please? The Fool and the Star Reversed. Um, someone in this situation hasn't quite healed from this yet and is not going to trust a word the other person says. Full Reversed, Star Reversed. One more.
Seven of Pentacles reversed. There's no hope for this. The Pentacle Bush done died, y'all. Mm -hmm. Eight of Wands, fast forward movement. I think this is just going to like fly through the weekend. Like, oh, by the way, like you might bump into this person suddenly out of the blue, out of the blue, those wands of truth come flying by you. I don't know where you might bump into them. Depends on where you're at, I guess. One more on that. One more on that before I get your advice as to what you should do. Okay, I'll take two. The Hanging Man in the Tower. This little communication might leave someone kind of emotionally stuck and might send a tower that has recently been built crashing down. You moved on to new people. You have your own blessed unions now, or at least one of you does. Depending on what you do with this, this might send a tower crashing down a little bit. So let's tell you what you should do. Queen of Cups reversed in the Three of Wands. Don't give this any emotion. J just don't. If, if this is something you've been waiting for, I mean, take it for what it is. But don't feed it any excess emotion. Uh, I'm going to urge you to not send your own tower crashing down. Ten of Pentacles upright, King of Pentacles reversed. You have way too much good going for you to even acknowledge whatever offer they're going to give you. Don't, just, no. Obviously, for whatever reason, it didn't work out. You disconnected. You found new people. Don't. Don't. My favorite phrase, do not engage. Do not engage. Just don't. Okay. <laughs> okay, water signs. That's what I have for you guys for this weekend. Well, some crazy energies coming out. Crazy scenarios. I don't know what's up with today. If you need closure, though, fine. Take the closure. Walk away. But don't feed the machine. Please don't feed the machine. Fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Love you guys. I'm not biased at all. I'm, I'm not. Fire signs hold a special place in my heart. After all, this is Fire Sign Tarot. Don't judge me. I love you all equally. Hugs and kisses to all my soul children. In all honesty, the fire signs are just going to get bopped on the head a little bit harder. That's all. Okay. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Six of Pentacles, Two of Swords. Hmm. Evening out of the playing field and a difficult decision being made? Possibly a blind decision being made? A decision being made without having all the information? What happened in the past? Ten of swords reversed, three of swords reversed. This 
Somebody didn't wait for something to close out. Okay. Nine of Swords, Three of Pentacles. Three of Pentacles is the... Re oh boy. Three of Pentacles is reversed. Consumed by something. It invaded your dreams. It invaded your thoughts. Bat poop bonkers. As to why it didn't stay together, why it, why it, why it crumbled, why it came apart. Why it didn't work out. All right, what's coming in for this weekend? Two of Pentacles reversed. Seven of Wands reversed. Somebody's gonna get sick of juggling and take control back. I like it. Okay. Why is the Seven of Swords, or sorry, why is the Ten of Swords and the Three of Wands reversed here? The moon reversed, the Ten of Pentacles reversed. Okay. Another reversed ten. There was money trouble. There was family trouble. Truths came out about what was happening with money, possibly. If that's your story, you know. There was a breakdown, and truths came out about it. Fogs were lifted. Somebody didn't hang out and wait. They just kind of left it hanging out there. I'm hearing somebody took the money and ran. Somebody took the money and ran. Not not quite sure where that's coming from. Why is the Nine of Swords and the Three of Pentacles reversed here? Six of Swords. At face value, you tried to move on from it. You crossed the river, you got to the other side of it, but it bothered you. It always bothered you. One more. The magician came out. It's in the upright, but I'm, I'm hearing the word manipulation. I'm not hearing manifest, I'm hearing manipulate. One more. Okay. Queen of Wands in the reverse. Some of you may have manifested the end to it, or someone tried to manipulate it. You're dealing with a manipulator and you put an end to it. You made it out on the other side of it anyway. But you were dealing with a very manipulative person. I, I keep hearing they took the money and ran. They were manipulative. They,
and blindfold. Blindfold. I don't know why. This might be something special for someone. I don't know. All right, what's coming in for this weekend? Why is the Two of Pentacles reversed? Seven of Wands upright here, and I just dropped a card. We had one fall, fly out onto the floor. Page of Pentacles. Oh, really? Apology? Okay. Four of Wands. Someone is going to try to come back in with an apology and try to even the scales try to make things right and you're gonna make the decision to really slam the door in their face and maintain control of what you had to put back together fire signs I like it Kid, nobody just don't mess with the fire sign just don't do it don't mess with fire sign. It's not a good idea. <sighs> Your advice. Five of Pentacles reversed and the Eight of Swords. You made it out on the other side. You made it through this. You came out on top of that mountain. Don't let them come back to try to consume you again. Don't do it. Just don't let it happen. The magician being in the upright, you manifested greatness out of this. You put a stop to it. It took a minute, but you put a stop to it. You made it out on the other side. You made it to the other side of the river. Whether you got in a hot air balloon and you flew over it, or you tread the water, you made it to the other side. Ace of Cups in the tower. I'm hearing remember the tower. That little apology and that little cup. Remember the tower. You have rebuilt your tower. You have rebuilt a tower that was knocked down. Do not let somebody come in to knock your tower down again. Okay. Fire signs, this is what I have for you. I gotta get ready for work, guys. Thanks for coming to hang out on a Friday. I appreciate you. We will be met back either Sunday night, Monday morning, Monday afternoon, depending on when I can get to the work week top and bottom, because you guys know I, I do these four day stretches between 10 and 12 hours and I, I just get wiped out. So we'll, we'll see what I can make happen. And I'm hoping to have the cycle finished by Saturday night as well. So, um, I'm going to try like hell. Um, you guys take care. I will see you next week. Love you to pets. Have a great weekend. Bye for now.